Cats have a reputation for being independent and aloof. But is your cat just playing hard to get? Researchers at the Oregon State University Human-Animal Interaction Laboratory are studying how cats relate to humans. So, are cats social animals? Let's find out. Can social cats read our intentions better than others? About 20 years ago, research showed that dogs understood human pointing. If a human pointed at one of two overturned bowls, dogs usually went to the one indicated. Human toddlers also passed this test, but chimpanzees failed. When researchers tested cats, they found cats performed as well as dogs. But many cats simply lost interest and walked away. Cats didn't seem as driven to please as dogs, which made them tough research subjects. However, Christian Vitali at OSU found that cats do understand pointing. Vitali, working with Monique Udell, discovered in 2017 that cats prefer interacting with people over food and toys. In 2019, they found that cats spend more time with people who pay attention to them. Social cats like to be around their people. Who would have thought? How socially smart is your cat? Try these simple tests in a quiet room with your cat. Does your cat recognize its name? Think of four words that sound like your cat's name. When your cat is calm, say each word out loud, pausing 15 seconds between each one. Then say your cat's name. If your cat perks up when you say its name, it likely knows its name. Is your cat antisocial? Sit in the same room with your cat, but focus on something else, like a book. Call your cat over. If it comes when called, reward it with praise and petting. If your cat stays distant, it may be more independent. Spending more time interacting with your cat may help it become more social over time. Can your cat read your emotions? Sit in a room with your cat and bring in an unsettling object, like a noisy fan. After a while, move to the object and pet it, saying nice things in a calm voice. If your cat calms down and even approaches the object, it can probably tune in to your emotional cues. What comes first for your cat, you or food? Sit on the floor with your cat. Place treats and toys around you. Notice where your cat spends most of its time. That's what your cat prefers. Try this in several locations to make sure your cat isn't just hungry. Studying social cognition in cats helps us understand how they interact with us. Understanding cat behavior can help strengthen our bond with both social and non-social cats. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe to Cats Globe. See you next time.